Hello everybody, Sean Games here, and today, look where we are, we're not on Minecraft anymore, ladies and gentlemen, we are on the Xbox, so here we go, welcome to Xbox Achievement Hunting! Okay, so to start off today's episode of Achievement Hunting, we are going to be working on a little thing called Forzathon. Um, we need to perform 10 threading the needle skills. So I looked this up before I recorded, and what we need to do for this is we are need to, going to head over to a place called Surfer's Paradise. There's like a beach strip drive down here that we can fast travel to. So for any of you guys who don't know what Forza Horizon is, it's an awesome game where basically it's an open world game. You can wander anywhere, you can do free roam, go do fun races, complete challenges, level up, play online, bunches of races, all that stuff. And it's really awesome, it's an open world game. You guys uh, should go check it out, look up Forza Horizon trailer. It's got some of the stuff you can do. So. I'm told that in this video, you just need to go between some of the cars, uh, something like that, and I can perform the, whoa, great, I hit something, great. So if you hit something, so this, oh wow, I just majorly hit something and I'm stuck, I think. Can I get out of this? Um, a skill chain is like a, chain of skills basically it's pretty self-explanatory where don't hit me um bait i keep running into stuff where um you do a bunch of skills and it gives you points and points give you skill points whoa please don't hit me and basically that's how you earn these things so i'm trying to get this skill it's called threading the needle although none of them have appeared yet did I get one? Yes, I got one. I got one. Don't hit anything now. Don't hit anything because I have one. I have one. And I have one. There we go. Okay, we got very low score on that. Dang it. I hate doing U-turns in this. It's always risky. Sometimes it can be scary. So we're going to head back around and we are going to do one more. So well, actually we need to do 10. So we're going to do a lot more. But now we have a better idea on how to do this. So... I don't see very many cars up ahead, so we're gonna have to keep going pretty far. Oh, why is there so little cars? Whoa, that doesn't count as a threading the needle. Threading the needle. There we go, that's definitely threading the needle. That's definitely, no doubt, that's, that's threading the needle. Whoa, how did I do that? How did I do that? That's two threading the needles, right? I'm not sure if that was. But let's try and do another one. Oh, here we go. Woo, there we go. Ah, oh, no, I hit something. Okay, here we go. Let's start a new skill chain. Through there. Through there. Nope. No, that didn't count. It's okay. We didn't hit it hard enough. No threading the needle? Okay, I swore one of those things had to be threading the needle. Whoa. Something like that. There. That should give us some sort of, what? No, really? Okay, let's keep going and let's see if we can get another one. Here we go. I only have like one so far. Need to get more. Whoa, trade and paint. Daredevil. Well, at least we're getting skill points. There's another achievement called I Want It All where we need to unlock all the achievements, all of them. So this is helping with um, that. Okay, we got a skill point, that's good. Let's keep going, try and get thread in the needle. So this is pretty much how you do it. So I'm gonna cut until we've got like eight or nine and we've got a pretty good idea on how we do this. So um, here we go, let's just, let's actually just do that and then we got a rare, we got, we got it, we got it. We did it, wow, okay. Well that was quick, so we did it. We got the thread in the needle skills. I guess somehow I didn't see them. Well, there we go. We got it. We got 
all of the Forza Thon challenges complete. So there we go. We got the Forza Thon Spring is here challenge now. Um, I've done most of the barn finds, but I got a barn find rumor. So we have barn find rumor, and I have 18 out of 19 barn finds. So we're gonna knock that out really quick. So it looks like today we're gonna get some good stuff. Um, I'm not sure how much this is worth, but I'm pretty sure it's a rare achievement. So let's go ahead and try to knock this one out. So here we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Whoa, that's, th at least this time though, I don't care about my skill chains. Although we did get a pretty good one going there. I think we got like 35,000 on one of them. There's a cool area called the drag strip. If you just do like burnouts and drifts, you can get some serious points. I actually got myself um, 100,000 100, skill points. Very good. Or total skills, so I think I got like three skills, skill points to spend. So that's good. I'm gonna keep going. We're gonna head on over to this area because this is where there's a supposedly a barn find. So a good way to find a barn find, I think this is a legendary barn find, let me check. I think, it, I think it's a legendary barn find, I'm not sure. I think I saw the barn find rumor and I think the guy who announced it said that it was legendary so this might be legendary but it's the 19th barn find so well it's my last barn find i don't know if it's everybody's but I, it might i might actually be a new one and i'm not sure this could be a new barn find because it's it's in the challenge so if anybody had already got it this could be a brand new barn find so maybe we'll get a brand new um forza Thon exclusive car so maybe it'll even be a horizon edition so we should head over horizon edition those give like Drift skill boosts, credit skill boosts for doing stuff. They're very good, especially if you're trying to level up or get skill points. They're very good for stuff like that. Very good. So if you just do that stuff, it's it's, it's incredibly good. Trust me. Okay, so here we are. We're in the barn find area. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go into a mode called drone mode. So we're going to leave our car, basically. There we go, now we're, we've left the car and we're in this little drone flying, whoa, watch the trees. We're in this little um, drone flying area now. For all I know, this could actually be, this is, a, well, it's, we're looking for a barn, so we need to find some sort of barn find. I'm just hoping we can get a lock on it. It's actually quicker to just look for it this way. It's also very quiet, no noise at all. These drones, they have like no noise. You can barely hear a thing, so. It, it's usually towards a road. It's usually not literally in the middle of nowhere, so I'm just gonna have to try and get lucky looking around. Oh, um, let's see. Uh, let's see. Uh, I think we're gonna need to turn this way. I see some crops. That may have to do with something. I'm not sure. I found all the other barn finds, so. Sorry also, by the way, if there's any background noise. A no there was just a noise in my house. I don't know if you guys heard it, so. Sorry if there's any background noise. This is literally the first time I'm doing this. I did one test recording before this. I'm like, all right, let's do this. It actually took a very long time to get set up. It took like seven hours to figure the thing out. It's very complicated. Um, I got an Elgato game capture, HD 60S. So if you guys want to, you can go check it out. Um, I'm not actually sponsored by them. I'm just letting you guys know because that's what I'm using if you like what my content looks like. So let's just try and find this barn and then we may have to wrap it up for today's episode. So let's go find, ooh, ooh, this looks promising. This is a dead end, so maybe this could end with the barn find. <gasps> I think I found the barn find. Yep, this is the barn find for sure. Yep, that's the barn find. All right, back. Let's get, let's get in the car and let's head on over. Well, it was at a dead end, so I guess I would have found it eventually anyway. So we gotta head pretty far out. There it is, I see the barn find from here. And it looks like we're gonna have to go off the road and get off-road in a Ferrari. I think this is this is one of the Ferrari's models. I'm not sure what the exact number is. I can't, I, I'm not totally sure. I'm starting to learn a lot about cars though from this game. I had Forza Motorsport 3 and 4, well my dad did. And I've played on, I played on that a bit, but um, this is my first personal Forza game. So let's see, what do we got? I'm pretty sure this is a brand new barn find. I haven't seen this on any YouTube videos on like how to find them. So let's see, what do we got? Hmm. 
Hmm, what's that? AMC Pacer. Awesome! Okay, so, whoa, what happened to my Ferrari? It just got really dirty there. Well, we've got all of them. I think we have. Now, to actually unlock the achievement, we actually need to get the car restored, which does take a little while. So, um, just letting you guys know, it is, it is for sure, it's achieved. So, we've got it. We just need, now we just need to have it get restored. Although, I think this is going to have to do it for today's episode. I'm not sure how long I've been recording for. And I don't think it says how, oh, it's, oh, it does say actually. It's been about ten and a half minutes. Maybe a little off, because I have to add in the intro and stuff. So, um, it looks like I'm going to have to end off the episode here, guys. I'm sorry that this episode's a little on the short side. It's not actually not that short, but it could be shorter. But I think this was awesome. Hopefully, if you're searching this stuff up, because some of this stuff's in Forzathon. I'm going to be doing um, videos like this, hopefully twice a week. And I will be doing Forzathon, because a lot of people look up Forzathons when they're happening. So, Forzathon, I'm going to let you guys know on. So, this is Season 1 of Xbox Achievement Hunter. Um, sort of this is kind of like the pilot episode although I already know I already know that I've got I've already got my own I got a license by me to do a full series so uh, hopefully this actually is a good fun season trying to unlock achievements and by the way I just wanted to add something for Minecraft for people for Skybounds I will be trying to continue that um, if I can soon I'm going to be doing this series, though, for a little while until I've gotten comfortable with it. Then I'll try and do a multi-series. It's going to be hard with this schoolwork coming up, coming with the end of the year. So um, I will see you guys later. Have an awesome day. Peace.